She writes, yes, I love being in dangerous situations with dudes in the habit of monetizing women for cash by pimping them out and who've been thrown off reality TV shows for hitting their girlfriends. I think that would go well for me because I'm a lobotomy patient with a humiliation fetish. She thought she'd been real clever there. I was like, eh. So <clears throat> again, this irritated me. Maybe this, this irritated me actually more than any of the comments. Do you know why? Because again, I can't stand the infantilization of women. I cannot stand it. So I will give you my reply and then I'm gonna expand on that a second. I wrote, if adult women choose to participate in a consensual webcam business, I won't infantilize them by claiming they've been pimped out. He was thrown off a reality show because of kink video. The girl in the video defended him. Not my thing in either case. Okay. Again, I don't like kink. I'm not into it. Like, I don't need my sex to be filled with injury. <laughs> Just not my style. Not my thing. Um, I personally don't like webcam. Like, I don't, I don't, it doesn't appeal to me. It's not something that I've thought to do. It's, it's not my thing, right? But are we talking about grown adult women or not? Because he did the kink video and the girl in the video who had been his girlfriend came out and said, that's what we used to do. I didn't have a problem with it. It was like we were putting it on for the camera a little bit and there's nothing going on there. There's no story there. So that's it. That's it. What am I supposed to say? Oh, no, honey. No, no, no. Let me infantilize her. No, no. That's not good for you. Didn't your mommy ever tell you? No, I'm not interested in playing that role. I'm interested in letting adults be adults, make the choices they make for themselves, and be honest with themselves about what they like, what they don't like. It's not my life to live. I'm not here to boss everybody around and pull Doritos out of their mouth and tell them not to do kink videos. You're an adult. You do what you want. Same for webcam business. He said in the video at one point somewhere, he said, I reached out to my, he was looking to make money and he reached out to, I guess it was ex-girlfriends or maybe it was girlfriends. Like he said he had a few girlfriends going on at the time and he reaches out to them and he says, this is what we're going to do. And he even says at one point, one or two of them, I think left, decided it wasn't for them. They weren't held there against their will. The girls were entering into a business partnership. They decided they wanted to make money that way. They were adults. It's up to them. Did he chain them to the bed? That would be a different story. I don't have evidence of that. Were they held against their will? I also don't have evidence of that. Am I, again, going to infantilize these women and say, no, no, no. Should we be doing this to all women that do OnlyFans? Should I be going up to every woman on OnlyFans? No, no, no. You can't do that. That's bad. You're, you're a little baby, and you need to be told that that's not good. I have no interest in that. You want, you're an adult woman. You want to do OnlyFans? Go do it. I don't care. I don't care. It's not my life to live. Do I think it's the, can I weigh in on the pros and cons and give my opinion? Sure, but I'm not gonna tell you what to do. Same thing for people who get involved in pornography, adults. I have no problem with that. I'm not gonna do it, doesn't interest me. I'm not gonna watch it. I think it's bad for society at large. I'm gonna weigh in on why I think it's bad for society at large. I'm not gonna tell you what to do. You're a grown ass woman. So what I love about this is the infantilization. Again, the left will, particularly women on the left, will constantly tell you that they're cheering for women. We love women. We're champions for women. And at every turn, they, they get an opportunity. They will remind you that they feel women are incapable of making their own decisions and that women shouldn't be held to a standard of personal responsibility and that women just, they, they can't think or, or take care of themselves in any capacity. They're being pimped out. How do you know they're being pimped out? How do you know that? You assumed, why? Because you infantilized them, that's why. If you wanna watch the full episode, click right here. And if you wanna ask me a question, talk one-on-one, -on -one, send me a FaceTime video, join a video with a group of your friends and me, you gotta download Minect and you gotta join me there. It's gonna be really hot.